Hi, Brett, ShySky.com. Today I'm going to show you a little trick that I figured out the other day that's actually going to save you possibly quite a bit of money because it has saved me quite a bit of money. I tore a bad battery apart in a 14-4 port cable drill. And the little battery units itself, I mean, some of them over time do get corroded and you can't jump start them or get them to take up a charge again. So I've sacrificed this battery. Um, to benefit me in, in other applications. The application is I have quite an expensive um, stream light flashlight. If you've ever went to buy one of the battery packs, they're relatively extremely expensive and I have found they don't really work that well or it didn't work that well for me. Um, so what I'm going to do is just show you real quick that I, that I have actually no light in here at all. I mean, I try to charge this thing and I'm just not getting any power out of it. And this was, this came out of a charger. So I'm going to do a couple. So as you can see, I'm just, I'm just barely picking up any volts at all. So I cut these down out of the battery pack. And three of these make up the same size as these NICAD batteries right here. Coincidence. Well, I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to come right over here, and I'm going to be pushing oh, almost at three. It still needs to be charged, and what I'm going to do is load this up in here and put these in series, and I should be able to have a little light coming out of this just because they're kind of weak, and there it is. So now I know that I've got a good functional set of batteries. and. I will also wrap these in plastic and shrink wrap them with my, my heat gun once I get the batteries out there that are good. So just another little tip for you from ShySky.com.